Hello, this is David, and I have a pretty interesting video to share with you today. We're going to be comparing 1.70 carats all the way to 2.30 carats, G to H in color, and VS1 to VS2 in clarity. With that said, they're all going to face up white, and they're all going to be eye clean. So starting from the left, we have a 1.73 HVS1, August Vintage Cushion, 2.09 HVS1, August Vintage Cushion, a 2 carat GVS1, Modern Cushion, 2 carat GVS2, Modern Cushion, a 2.3 GVS1, Modern Cushion, and then on top we have a 2 carat HVS2, Hearts and Arrows Cushion. And we are viewing these under fluorescent lighting, which is similar to office lighting. And I'm already pretty sure which one I would eliminate based on optical performance. It would have to be the 2.35 GVS1. While it is not a horrible looking diamond and it does not have the crushed ice effect, it has too much brightness right underneath the table and not enough contrast to really catch your eye. Whereas the Hearts and Arrows cushion has the perfect amount of contrast. Um, this 2 carat GBS2 isn't horrible at all either. Same with this 2 carat GBS1 here. And then with the August Vintages, whole different ballpark in terms of optical performance and personality. Alright, we're going to move on to spotlighting. Alright. As you may know, certain diamond cuts do better under certain lighting conditions. For example, the August Vintage Cushions still throw off those big flashes of light under LED or spotlighting, but not as much as the moderns do, and you can see this right here. Okay, so I'm moving along. The two modern cuts that we have right here, the 2 carat GVS1 on the left and the 2 carat GVS2 on the right, are very similar. But if you're searching for a modern cushion cut, and you want that optical symmetry to be perfect, your eye might be going towards the top right, which is the Hearts and Arrows cushion. And on the bottom right, this one's actually doing pretty well under this lighting. Now we're going to move on to intense spotlighting. Okay, now we are under intense spotlighting, which is 5800 Kelvin, so it sometimes gives off a slightly warmer cast onto the diamond. And this is the closest thing we can replicate to sunlight in our store.
So between these four modern cushions, I am definitely leaning towards the top right, which is the Hearts and Arrows cushion, and then this one right in the middle, right here, which is the 2 carat GBS2. Great light performance for a modern cut cushion. Nice even light distribution throughout the entire diamond, whereas this one on the left goes a little bit dark on the edges. So it would be between this one and that one. And lastly, we're going to move on to um, natural daylight, and I'm just going to be comparing the 2.09 HVS1 August Vintage Cushion, the 2 carat GVS2 Modern Cushion, and the 2 carat HVS2 Hearts and Arrows Cushion. Okay? Last but certainly not least, we have the 2.09 HVS1 August Vintage Cushion. 2 carat GVS2 modern cushion and the 2 carat HVS2 Arts and Arrows cushion. And this is my favorite lighting because it's pretty honest with how the diamond's going to appear on a cloudy day. So if you're going for a pinpoint sparkle, choose one of the moderns. If you want something that's more bold and throws off larger facets of light, you might want to consider the vintage. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed and have a great night.